You better subscribe. Go on, do it. Hey, welcome back to Scarlet Nexus. I don't know why I'm holding the computer. Hey, welcome back to Scarlet Nexus. Today we're gonna be playing Scarlet Nexus. I know I'm I'm kind of out of my league right now, out of my game right now. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of out of my fa uh, my brain isn't working today. I except this morning when I grew, my brain doubled in size and I built my own Yuito cosplay. It wasn't that good, but it was okay. I don't have it with me right now. I would wear it, but it's kind of embarrassing to everybody would make fun of me for it because they already have. So, Arshi looks so different from the way they present her on TV. She's always lazy when she's not on camera, so a lot of people call her Lazy Aura. Lazy Aura? <laughs> that suits her perfectly. That was rude. I heard you took down another major Stop author. talking. Oh man, I wish I could have fought with you. It wasn't broadcast this time. Weren't the crows there? No. A lot was going on. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I can watch TV. An extremely dangerous other appeared in Kikushiba. However, once again, the Scarlet Guardians managed to dispatch the monsters in a timely matter. Grabbing the lime... Grab... Wait, no. <clears throat> Grabbing the limelight was Private Yuicho Tsuburagi, who managed to fin finish off a major other on its very first mission. A remarkable achievement for one's first battle. We can expect great things to come from this new Scarlet Guardian. They were just talking about me. Wow, it's fake nature. And it's also me. Okay. So this is how I do stuff. That's how I like go into the main story kind of. And this is just kind of where things happen. Happen. Let's talk to you. Yeah. Smiling at the crows as the head of the PR. I know it's smiling. Ugh. I know it's her job, but I'd never get it be able to do what Arashi does. Okay. Yo, Arashi. Hanabi. The hideout is like a secret base. So exciting. Do you think it's okay if I let some personal if I left some personal belongings? Ooh, bond episode. Yuito, wanna talk? I mean, we're on the same team now. Sure okay, thing. But what do you want to talk about? We've known each other since we were kids. You pretty much know everything about me. Uh, you know, we didn't see much of each other since joining up. I thought we could catch up. Catch up? I guess we haven't had the time to really sit down and talk. Right? Why don't we go take a walk out of the city? Okay, let's go. You know, Yuito is giving me, like, giga chat energy. Like, Seems like a cool dude. I don't want to do this. This is not fun. I want to beat up some beastly boys. I kind of want to beat up some beastly boys. Not completely. I mean, it's fun. Just I haven't been on a relaxing walk like this in a while. Me neither. I've been on missions constantly since being assigned. We need to take time for ourselves like this now and then. So, what were you doing between the time you were scouted and the time you joined? Well, during my time at the Academy, I studied, trained my power, and hung out with friends. Me too. I guess there's not too much difference between the scouted and volunteer soldiers. Yeah, we were both headed to the same place in the end. What about everything else? How are your parents? They're both doing great. Just the other day, they kept messaging me while they were on a date for their wedding anniversary. <laughs> They're so carefree. I'm glad to hear they haven't changed. I found myself ignoring their calls for a while. It feels nice to talk like this again. 
It's only been two years, but it feels like we haven't seen each other for much longer. Two years? It's still yeah. a lot. It really does. Are you okay? It's nothing. Anyway, can I ask you something? Sure. What's up? So, um, what do you think about Kasane? She's a jerk. <laughs> huh? Why are you suddenly bringing up Kasane? Well, you know, we're catching up. I wanted to ask you something that must be on your mind. And it seems like you've been thinking about Kasane. A lot. It did? Well, I guess I've been curious about her. Ooh, what do you mean by that? Get the quash. I don't know how to put it. I can't get Kasane's face out of my mind. You can't? No. Her face looks exactly like the person who saved me when I was a kid. I'll never forget that face. So when I met someone who had the same face, I started to wonder if they were somehow related. Oh, so it's just because she looks like the person who saved your life. Yeah, that's right. The reason why I even volunteered for the OSF is because I wanted to be like the person who saved my life. She's the ideal image of what the OSF should be. <sighs> that wasn't exactly the direction I was going for, but I guess that's fine. Then what did you want to know? I'll try to answer. It's okay. It's not a big deal. You know, you're really amazing. You've had this goal since you were a child, and you've been working towards it all your life. Your nose just look weird. <laughs> no, I'm not amazing at all. You're way more amazing, because you were actually scouted. That's not true. Being scouted meant that I had no choice but to enlist. You didn't want to join the OSF? It's not that, but I never thought about what I wanted to do in the OSF. That's so like you. You're more comfortable taking action than you are thinking. Hey, that seems like a roundabout way of calling me stupid. What? No, I, I didn't mean it like that at all. You just put more stock into being proactive. Wait, uh, that's not much better. I'm not this move where there's like- I'm just joking. I know what you mean. Ready to head back to the hideout? Yeah. Thanks for inviting me out. I'm really glad we got to talk like this again. It was a short I talk. I had fun too. Um, do you want to talk again like this sometime? <laughs> that sounds good. Let's do it. Okay, it's a promise. Don't forget. I won't. You better not forget either. I definitely won't. Well, let's head back to the hideout. She hasn't changed. She's so cheerful and energetic. I feel recharged. Okay, back to business. Let's get down to business. Uh, you haven't changed at all. Stop really? talking to me. Really? I mean, but I'm a bit happy that you haven't changed. Just staying being you. What is Baki? What is Baki? I want to know. I want to know. I, you know, I'm going to look it up later. Okay. Let's get, uh... Okay. To get to know you better, you know? Oh, like fighting habits? I guess that would be important if we're fighting together. Sorry about that. A message from Kasane? I should check it right away. Can we meet up? There's a lot I need to talk to you about. I'll be waiting in Kikushiba. Fine, I'll do it. I wish I could choose and be like, call from Kasane. Maybe I can ask her a little bit about the person who saved me. 
His eyes are so wide, there's like, Kasane. Maybe I should ask her about the one who saved me. How do they do it though? Do they like push you out of the way of like a, a building? Or are they like, I don't know. It probably explains later. Sorry to keep you waiting. So, what is it? I'm glad you get straight to the point. I was getting tired of people who force small talk. <laughs> Thanks. I figured. Is there anyone you like? What? Why is she asking me that? Does she? What's your type? What are your plans for your future? She are you interested in taking over Randall Industries? What's going on? Wait, hold on. Why are you asking me that? I'm running a background check. Is that why you called me here? Not just that. Captain Seto seems to have dropped his fountain pen around here Seto. somewhere. Seto. I wanted to talk to you anyway, so I thought I'd ask you what you knew about it. His fountain pen? Now that you mention it, I guess Captain Seto like the textures are kind of glitching on her hand. How come you're looking Wait. for it? I don't, I don't think even they you are. like to ask too many questions. Oh. What? That's a perfectly normal question to ask. Don't look at me like that. We can talk while we look for the pen. Oh. <sighs> Fight looking for a pen. Is this like a side quest or something? Psychokinesis, you tell. Okay. Okay, that's cool. I can try that. It sprayed something like oil. Let's do it. Don't get it on you. I can still do that. Whoa. I can do this. Oh yeah, that was pretty cool. Okay. Gotta continue on our merry way. What's that? Why do we care about some dumb fountain pen? This is what we need to go on. Hey, I bet Captain Seto would be happy if we found the fountain pen. Yeah. Sure would. Okay. Well, let's do our best then. <laughs> okay. Conversation is non-existent, but I have to ask her about the person who saved me. Oh, we can walk around. Hey, Kasane. You look like the person who saved me. This isn't they don't push you around, is he? Okay. Is this part of the main story? If so, they ran out of ideas Looks like way a too early. Nearby. Looks like there's a resource nearby. I don't know. Why are there... Is, does that mean we're going to have to fight a boss soon? It's odd since it's at a I guess you're not as useless area. in battle as I thought. Oh, man. She's really harsh. Stop being mean. Hey, I have something I want to ask you, too. What? He's cringing when I was already little, thinking about it. I was attacked by another and almost died. But then someone from the OSF saved me. And she looked just like you. So, I was wondering if you knew anything about it. We're about the same age. 
When you were a child, I would have been one too. No, I mean, maybe you have a much older sister. Shh, quiet. There it's a big ol' other. An enemy. Get ready to fight. That's okay. a lot of flowery ladies. Come on. Oh, here. Hmm, I couldn't tell. Oh. Oh, I guess I can do it again. That was cool. Is that a brain crush attack? Let's see. Oh uh, yeah, quadruple kill. Is that it? That was easy. Easy done. Looks like we won. Huh? Isn't that Captain Seto's fountain pen behind you? Uh, yeah. This is it. Thanks. You were a big help. Anyway, back to what you were saying. And a big boy is gonna come attack. Who saved me? Did you check the OSF registry? Of course, but I didn't find her. I thought maybe she was discharged. Oh, right. The person who saved me had the exact same hair clip as that one. Can you tell me where you bought yours? That's she got it from her mother. mother. My sister made this for me. Did I say brother? I don't know. What? Really? Hmm. Your power is psychokinesis too. Do you think you might be having realistic dreams? Dreams? Hmm. I can't really say for sure. I was a kid at the time, and my memory is a bit hazy. I've always had strange dreams. Oddly realistic dreams. A woman mutters something about red strings, and then red threads encircle me like a cocoon. I thought my dreams were real when I was a child. It was confusing. I thought that since you also have psychokinesis, maybe you had realistic dreams, too. No, I'm sure it wasn't a dream. It has to be real. That person gave me this ear cuff. I see. Then I don't think I can help you any further. Oh, no, I... Uh, I'm sorry. That was a weird thing to bring up. It's fine. Well, we found the fountain pen. So I guess I'll head back. Right. Thank you. I really that hope was that wasn't part country. of the main story, since... Oh, right. I completely forgot that was a thing. Uh... Why me? Alright. Goodbye. I'll head back, too. Yeah, I'm level seven. Come to Kikushiba. Receive a brain message. Let's see. I forgot to ask you something. What are you into? This is part of the background check. Well, what am I into? I like Baki and like. Who is Baki? Who's Baki? You know what? This episode was relatively uneventful, but I think, wow, I got a lot of stuff. Goodness, I got a lot of stuff. Well, I think today has been relatively uneventful. So, um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.